have you um have you changed your hair charlene oh it's nice yeah oh, thank you <laughs> um yeah. no we're just messing around with it really oh cool oh it's yeah new it house new me <laughs> new you yeah <laughs> i mean it looks nice now and and before still it looked nice before but it also looks good now so you can keep it like or change it or yeah i'm just messing around with it whatever. in lockdown yeah 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 Not that i've got anywhere to go but no that's that's a shame it would be nice to go some you for you to be able to go somewhere mm. by by yourself or with someone or with whoever or just, where, out really um, anyway so um, have you um been out jogging again yeah no crossfit um working on the old glutes the the old lower body strength things <laughs> okay anyway um business so um yeah. apparently tsb issued a card which was in gary's name but it's due to run out in a couple of weeks so i really don't think we need to worry about it and um do you know what was really strange actually because all those transactions stopped on exactly the day we uh, last discussed it with Darren. Weird. Yeah, oh, funny that. It's almost yeah. like whoever it was suddenly realised that we'd got wind of them. Yeah, almost, yeah. yeah. Although there was a transfer for sixteen, yeah, £16,000 to a Mr Johnny Knight. Knight? Knight? Do we know him? 16 grand to Johnny. Yeah, do we, do we know who that is? Um, yeah, I know who he is. He's, he's a theatre director that we represent I and mean, we've done for years. But cool, cool. Yeah, I did think it was a pretty large amount of money. So um, yeah. whoever's got the card has made the authorization. That's, uh, that's the important thing. But, but no, I mean, and surely it's, it's illegal, isn't it? I mean, with Uncle Gary dead, it must be fraud. Oh, God. Uh, Ford. Maybe it's for that online no. cabaret thing they're doing. <sighs> right, I'm going to phone Darren after this and I'll find out. Cool, I'm going to cross that off my to-do list then. That's done. Uh... Oh, um, Parkwin, there's someone in the waiting room. I'm not expecting oh, okay. Um, no, don't think so. Better let them in. <laughs> oh. Um, it's Darren. Hi. On this call. Sorry. Oh, hi. Sorry. Hi. What is? We weren't um, expecting anyone. Oh, sorry. Is Darren on this call? Darren Dupree. Is he coming on? No. No. Where, where did you get the the details for this this me um, meeting? <laughs> You're a very interesting receptionist. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm the wife of Gary Stacy, and I'm looking to speak with Darren Dupree. So. Oh. Wife? Wow. I didn't even know Uncle Gary had remarried. Yeah, two years ago in Ibiza. It was a lovely ceremony. I had a Vera Wang dress. <laughs> That's when he was unwell. So, <laughs> how did you even meet? I was his massage therapist. We were very much in love. And he left me half of all of his assets. Really? Uh, so shall I? Um, really? sh shall I take minutes? Um, or I tell you what, I could press record, or even just like clear out, and we can wait for legal and arrange another meeting some other time. I already have a lawyer. Uh, when... Right. Um, okay. Look, I don't know who you are or where you've come from, but it sounds to me like you're just trying to get Uncle Gary's money, which isn't going to happen. So unless you present me with some kind of phantom marriage certificate, we've nothing further to discuss. Sorry, Tarquin. Speak later. What? Got a call to make. What? Oh, no, no. Hang on. Um, Charlene, don't... Why? What's that um, problem? No, no problem. Just a uh, new flat and hair. Um, so, uh, oh, it's been quite a day. So, uh, shall I take a message, maybe? And then I can just pass that on to Darren, and I'm sure we can get this all solved. <laughs> yeah, um, well, tell Darren... I'll see him in court and I'm just going to get my money. All right. Okay. Well, I'm sure we don't need to <laughs> bring in courts or anything. Um, shall I delete this recording? 
going to delete this recording.